local theater company is in its 51st season with a rich history of performing works in Central Illinois before you see them anywhere else. Here now on the CI stage with me are Vivian Kirshnan, costume designer and board member, as well as assistant director Jacqueline Moreno. Welcome to both of you. Okay, the show kicked off last night there at the Station Theater. What production has come to town, Jacqueline? So it's essentially very golden age Spanish plays. Um, it is a female play playwright. So if you want to go see something very funny and just full of feminist um, themes and messages, this is the show for you. It is amazing. The actors are phenomenal. It is just a lot of fun. What is the plot? What is the story about? Oh gosh, it's all over the place. I picture telenovelas and just drama, dramatics. Um, he's in love with her, who's in love with this person, who's in love with so and so. It's all over the place, but the actors are able to tell it in a way that you can easily follow along. It's just a lot of romance and comedy. So who would be a good audience for this production? Because I'm not thinking maybe the younger crowd. Um, honestly, even the younger crowd too. They. Um, we're going to get to it in a second, but the costumes are just very eye-catching. Cat cat Again, the plot, it sounds complicated, but it's very easy to follow. Um, just anyone, anyone who's just very interested in both Spanish age the the theater and just theater in general. It's just such a fun opening play. It's just, it, it's a lot. Something people need to yeah. come and experience yes, for themselves. Yes, exactly. Yes. yes. Okay. Well, let's talk about the costumes, you yeah. being the costume designer. Um, tell me a little bit about the wardrobe of the show. Yeah. So um, House of Desires has a lot of innuendo in it, the show itself. So some of the pieces here are um, some examples of just the fun and also maybe a little sensual looks that you might see in the show. Um, but just following with the historical theme, uh, we kind of wanted to follow through with that 1690s uh, Spanish Baroque. So you'll have pieces like these male um, doublets that uh, men would wear. Um, there's some nice textures. We got lots of gold trims in this time period, lots of pearls and jewelry for the women. So, um, Did you design these yourself? Um, I did a collection. I designed the costumes, but they'll come from some rentals from Cranert Center. Some things were built by hand, and then a little mix and match of um, new pieces to be styled to look like old historical costumes. Well, yes, so this is the first time that the Station Theater has performed a Spanish Golden Age play. What made you all decide this would be the great, a great production to, to present to the community? Well, I mean, we don't get too many plays by female writers from that time. Um, and I think now is, um, there, there's no other time like now to get a nice highlight of both a female writer who rev revolutionized both that era of plays and just in general. Um, and also like we've been moving into a lot of like minority plays and stuff like that. There's a lot in of that in the show. And I think Spanish Gold Golden Age is one of the per one of the most not w most known because we tend to stick with Shakespeare and stuff like that. Spanish plays isn't done a lot, so I think we're in the business of doing stuff that maybe you might not see anywhere else. Well, there you go. And where can people catch this show? It, it all kicked off yesterday, mm -hmm. but there's still plenty of opportunity to see the show. When and where can they can they catch it? At the Station Theater in downtown Urbana. Um, we have tickets online that you can also purchase through there. Um, tickets are selling very quickly, so I please bet. go online and buy tickets. It's this an weekend show. and next weekend. Yes, Thursday exactly. through Sunday, I think, and then okay. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, we saw the Facebook page where people can learn more about the House of Desires. Thank you so much for coming, Thank and you. we wish you and your production the best of luck. If you want to learn more about everything happening at the Station Theater, there's a look at the information there about House of Desires, which we of course will share at our website, CILiving.tv.